Thanks, Scruffy. Oh. You in a box? Kick my butt. Hello, world. Good morning from Australia. It is a nice, brisk, I think it's like 46 degrees Fahrenheit. I'm not sure what it's in Celsius at the moment, but it's winter time here in Australia. Winter time. Good morning. I don't know what kind of birds, but they're gorgeous. Three of them down there in that tree. I can hear birds singing this morning. Uh, no koalas. I was hoping for a koala. Making some noise. The wife said the last time she was here, the koalas were running around. I haven't seen a kangaroo this morning. Saw kangaroos yesterday, though. But they're around here. Um, so I'm getting ready to get a cup of coffee. And hopefully you guys enjoy the day. Getting ready to go down to the farm. Check it out. Tangos are not. Hopefully you can hear some of the birds. A lot of singing this morning. Uh, it's almost, uh, I don't know, maybe 10. Something to, something to that effect. On, yeah, 11 o'clock. 10.30. 10.30, all right, look at that beautiful, beautiful land, it's on stilts, basically, yeah, keep uh, all the dangerous animals out from, out of the house, so awesome, yeah, look at that, beautiful, beautiful, look at that, here comes the wife and the uncle coming down from the house, Getting ready to go down to the farm, pick some oranges. Yeah. Farm is down this way. Somewhere down here. Yes, seeking help for loons on the Gold Coast. Community groups say couples age 14 months for accommodation. Now at least the rope go down. One of the workers in Southport are being given duress allowance to get to their cars. Hopefully, hopefully. Hopefully you've got no tree fell on the road. No trees on the road, hopefully. Hopefully. <laughs> or else. So we, we gotta get go. through. Yeah. Otherwise well, we're gonna come back and pick it up the chainsaw. <laughs> The thing you worry about here is the fire. Oh, okay. That's the only part from that. We are right there. But that's why we we careful when we burn something. Mm -hmm. You know, when we burn our rubbish, you have to be very careful. When no wind, we burn our rubbish. The old place to sleep before the house. Yeah. The yeah. We park here. We go. Okay. Lemonade. lemonade nice organic it nice. yeah nothing fell yeah. Oh, there's the old caravan that they used to live in yeah, orange, orange is over there yeah. orange tree very nice oh sweet Oh yeah. These but are nice. Not, not for, for them, these for us. Oh. Uh -huh. <laughs> we, 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 we cut it ourselves and make our... These are orange and we're going to come back and uh, we walk the other side of the... Yeah. Ah, uh, they're eating the sugar canes. Yeah. <laughs> we come back and cut some sugar cane there if there's anything. Those yeah. are mango there. No mangoes growing yet. No, no, no food here. Yeah. yeah. You, guys, you, you guys used to have star fruit, right? Mandarines. Yeah. Mandarines. Oh, okay. Mandarines are growing. Why do you have the teddy bears? Oh. <laughs> because we used to put on the banana so we can stop the turkey eating the fruits. <laughs> but because they know it's not a real. So look at the teddy bear. It's like a scarecrow to scare away the turkeys. How awesome. <laughs> All right. Teddy bear. They're going away. See the house from over here, huh? 
Oh, very nice. House is way up there. See the house. The boundaries up the top. And then down at the bottom. 42 acres of jungle. Pretty awesome. Very nice. What's that? Lime tree. Grapefruit. Two mango trees. Grapefruit. Lime tree. Oh, pretty awesome. <laughs> Which one is that? Just smell it. You squeeze and smell it. That make an oil out of it. Eucalyptus. Mm, very nice. Holy cow. Smells good. Wow. <laughs> I like nice. the aroma. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Those are, we got uh, some uh, best, some food there, there on, on that one there. We got mm -hmm. some best food that we grow there. Okay. And also here, these are quite a few mangoes here. This is my job there. That we come in, we can't go through. There's a big tree here in front of you. Yeah. So that's my job I've been doing that. Cutting down the tree over here? No, cutting because they can't get through them. Can't get through? Yeah. Wow. We, we just only planting for, for ourselves. Yeah. That's the thing we didn't plant mm -hmm. for selling or anything. We just a big tree. Yeah. Oh. Live off the land. I've been Big cutting bad. this one here because they cross the road here mm. and we can't get through so I've been cutting here and these are mango when they mm. fruit they are a lot of fruit mm. mango the season, here. Yeah. season hasn't started uh, the mango fruit here because they all different area different time of fruiting our side here we fruit uh, next year by uh, February we still got a fruit. Next year we still got fruit on the mango. Mm. We are the latest one by the look. Mm. We need to do that. So I cut it. I use a huge pull it here and chunk from over there to here. These are the these are the wood. The one they the one they if you cut the yeah. timber and sell it very expensive. I'm, I come back again. Here. That's why I put the rock here because they come and oh, start digging. They they, they suck it up. Uh. They tuck it here and eat it, and the tree fell down. No food. So the, that's uh, who's digging it? Which which yeah, animal? One of the animal. Uh, one of the animal they uh, dig for water. Like a a turkey, but uh, tool of the. So we try to do this again, we try to plant, but there used to be a good, some good banana here before. But now I know we're going to go back to the one day. Some kind of, similar to the turkey that comes and digs and... Look at the bamboo. Yeah. Oh, yeah, very nice. Look at that, nice and tall. Pretty awesome. Bamboo trees. See how big that is? Wow. This is our joke when it's summertime when the frost grows. Uh -huh. I hate when the frost grows. <laughs> because we've got a lot of work to do. Yeah. So this is winter time. This one. This one. This one. This is the bear here. A tree there. Pears. Is that your side right there too? Yeah. yeah. See, this one are clean with the machine. All these ones are cut the white. Right. Uncle, what kind of tree this is? 
That's a lychee. 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 Yeah. I just saw the fruit there. Yeah. The dead one. This one is a plant. Yeah. Right here. The lychee. <laughs> plum tree. I'm going show a plum tree. I gotta go up go up there. Yeah, plum tree. Living off the land. It's very nice. Dragon fruit. Dragon fruit. <laughs> well, we used to have we used to have uh, some fruit on the dragon fruit, but this year I don't know what happened. It's a coffee tree there. Coffee tree. And uh, custard, custard tree. Pineapple. Right here. Pineapple. Pineapple. Pineapples. Custard tree here. Custard? Yeah. Never see a fruit. How long they will be <laughs> planting that while we're still waiting. Waiting for the fruit. See all these ones that can't, we can't clear. Huh. Because there's only two hands. We can't clear reach so easy like that. Yeah. We just plant whatever we need. Look at the banana there because no water. I remember last time you guys had rain. Oh. Huh. Oh, it's more than that. Oh. The soil are really dry. Yeah. Really dry soil. Yeah, you can feel it's dry. This mango here. Uh -huh. Oh. Really, really big mango fruit on this guy here. But we we throw the we throw the the fruit we, we eat one mango the seed we throw that <laughs> goes another. Yeah. <laughs> so this is the boundary from this side here. Coming from here. And here straight out of back there before they go right up the top there. Mm -hmm. Straight up where the waterfall is, before they go right up the top there behind the house. That's across there. And the next one is uh, National Park. Mm. National Park. How do you know where the boundary ends? Eh? How do you know where the boundary ends? Because they have to look at how, how they build a stone. Okay. If they stack the stone higher, so that means that's, that's the, the boundary. boundary. Yeah. Um. Sometimes they got a big there. You can see they got mm -hmm. a mark on, but sometimes they cut the tree. The tree, they got a mark on the tree. So you look at those ones. The people, I didn't know until people say to me, oh, this is how you're looking. Because uh, myself, I didn't know. And I say, how do you know? The, so they explain to me how. Mm. Nice. He's right next to the National Forest. So, I was so it was a big, from there to up the big there. backyard. Oh, well, uh, big, huge backyard. Where the koala bears are at. And the kangaroos. <laughs> oh, are you allergic to Australia? <laughs> Allergic to me. Come on top of the house. Me and Roy pull the cage all the way from up there where the where the cage is, our cage is. Uh-huh. We pull this cage all along. Pull the fence. Me and Roy from there right up to the family here. See all the cage Yeah. The so that's your boundary? Yeah. Here, all the way along. The end of the this is beautiful land. I like it. I like it. Oh, look at that. 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 Look at this belong to the government. 
the government. The council, council. This block of land here, all that that side there, this between the creek here, all that uh, belong to the council. Nice. Yeah. Uh, the hundred, hundred and something acres land. Imagine if you hold a, if you own a hundred, so you go on and on and on. Mm -hmm. Are we okay? We like the 42, not big. Really <laughs> not too big, not too small. Yeah. No, we, we, we like it. Because most of this land, we buy parcels. Like a parcel? Uh-huh. You're not gonna, unless you are uh, building in homes. Yeah. Well, that's the thing, different stones, different plants. Because you have to buy how many blocks. But here, if you have, they have a different law on a big block. Guava uh, is a European one. So, when, when the crops are grow well, uh -huh. me and Amy, we start from here or either we start from there, work our way this way, or we start from here, work our way up <laughs> towards that way. <laughs> <laughs> Saw some birds. Don't know if I got it on camera. No big animals walking around right now. Uh huh. That's why I keep worried if you come by yourself. I yeah, want you got uh, four or five dogs. Uh huh. She's able to attack you. Four, four or five wild dogs can no, attack. Uh, oh yeah, dingo are so strong. Yeah. So strong, so so strong. Like a Look at that. Oh, you can see the mango. <laughs> but we give it away, we share it to everybody. We give it to the kids, we give it to... We got a bucket of mango, we give it to the kids. Some of our, of our friends. All right, who's poop? Kangaroo poop? Yeah. Kangaroo yeah. poop? Yeah. That was fresh. <laughs> yeah, smoke is poop. Lucky we didn't see some wild pigeon here. No wild pigeon? Poops are starting coming. We come and fill with uh, this, all these bottles. Uh -huh. We come and fill with, uh, with the beer. With beer? We get rid of uh, fruit fly. Oh, oh okay. So we come and open up and we put it here inside, fill it up. Uh -huh. So instead of going and get the pollen of the mango, they go in there and uh, or go and... Yeah, that's what we... We, we, we used to do all of mango, but they all fell down. And uh -huh. even see, when you have a look at the, the food of that mango, they, they've been eating uh, all of yeah. it. If yeah. A big bunch of banana there, they demolish there everything. Wow. Where that dragon food is, where I put the dragon food, there used to be a lot of banana there. All banana. Nearly about 20 banana there. And when we first had a fruit, holy moly, big one. But after that, when they know, they realize plenty of food, they eat it. <laughs> See what you can do with 40 acres on the side of a mountain? A lot. It means the angry we leave the hole in the thing <laughs> Look at they all demolish the sugar cane. Mm -hmm. But they pull it down, they eat it, but they eat the soft part. That's why they, they yeah. eat mm -hmm. the soft part. They fell down. And they completely stand on, <laughs> and then the other group coming at night time, about 20 of them, they demolish the whole thing. <laughs> yeah. So the wild turkeys are coming and eating up all the fruits and stuff that has water in it.
Smell that one. What's that one? Mm -hmm. Smells. Smells good. I don't know what it does, what it is. Look at how they grow back. The the jungle oh, right God, wants to take over again. As soon as I think, everything's so bad. <laughs> yeah. That's how. Yeah. Here, everything here just leaves a big tree. But look at them. The jungle grows Look's back. A brown pear. This one here. Mm. And here now they flower. There's some no bee food. Nice. And, and look at this other part. This one here, we plant. Oh, now it's going to be not be 10 years. 10 years? <laughs> Trying to fruit. Oh, they start. Yeah, they start now. They start getting... Hopefully, for well, this year, we're thinking, hopefully this year, we get some fruit. <laughs> this one here. That's why we... I said to you, when we can see the fruit, but the one we have down there, here in the caravan, was so good and so big, that we end up by treatment. Dead, dead. What do you think about that smell? That's really good, yeah. See, they are using for their curry. Their curry? Curry, yeah. yeah. They, they it ask, has like a yeah, medicine. Yeah, we, we supply, smell. yeah, it's a medicine. And also it's a herb they're using for food. They, uh, they're using I don't know if India is using for curry as well, but Fijian people are using for medicine and cooking as well. So, yeah, wild growing here. We just bring it down here and put it there. Imi put it there and look at it. The Fijian asked and Imi took some for at the church. The what? Oh, the grapefruit? Oh, yeah. And Indians, they walk down here, and they, we're waiting for them, they take forever. <laughs> they, they talk, they talk, they talk, they talk. What do you think, Patricia? 42 acres of pure joy. <laughs> how, much, how much the property in our way? Oh, money, yeah. yeah. It doesn't matter where in Hawaii. Yeah. Very expensive over there. Yeah. Uh, uh, side that because America got a lot of uh, island there as well, right? Yeah. Like Jamaica. Yeah. Other countries. The, like, uh, the tourist islands are expensive. Yeah. yeah. Oh. When it's heavily populated by tourism, mm -hmm. it can get expensive, yeah. Yeah, we, we, we watching that, uh, that program live. Yeah. Live. And, uh, we, we watching some people that go to the island, the real estate, or, oh, hey, they selling property. Oh, yeah. yeah the and, house uh, alone is so expensive. Yeah, they go towards the water, the trees. Yep. Um, Oh. Yeah, we're looking at the, some property there. Oh, before, oh, here is a coal mine when we, in the 80s. Mm -hmm. It was a, you got the money, you get a big property. Yeah. But not now. Not anymore. Not even more people start realize, oh, geez, I have to hang on to my property. And some people, especially when you go to the to big town and big city, like Gold Coast, you have to, if you work at one acre, so you might be able to put four blocks there, four to five blocks. Because now they allow things to kill in 45 square meters. 45. That means you touch other people's wall. Yeah. <laughs> I was waking up this morning telling the neighboring birds to be quiet. Be quiet, <laughs> birds! <laughs> 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 Too
Too much noise, birds. <laughs> no, it's so beautiful. Look at that. I'm going to get the uh, stick maybe there. We're going to, we're going to, and uh, fucking we're going to pull some uh, mandarins. Yeah. Nice. Up there and, and Harvest some, some mandarins. Yeah. So Miss Green Thumb is thinking about it. <laughs> Okay, we are going to be harvesting some mandarins off of Uncle's farm, 42 acre farm, alongside of a mountain. We just got through walking around, showing us where all, everything's at, getting some mandarins. Right here. Well, I'm about to try and see if it's, if it's, if it's uh, sweet. He's not sure it, how you can tell it. Sometimes it might be dry. Oh. Yeah. So that means it's dry. It looks very nice and juicy. Oh, well, it's a time to... to, to Let's to, check to, it out. It's a big one. Seems like, yeah. Seems like uh, Not sweet. Oh, uh, let's see what... Uh, it's pretty like. stiff. Hey? You saw? Not, not too not soft. Really, eh? Not really soft. Because that's why I said to him, yeah. don't, don't take it again. I don't know if it's going to be fully ripe. Yeah, because if we, if it's not really that soft. Down, that means it's okay. Mm. If it not fell down, that means it's still living yeah. on the tree. Until they really... The only yeah. thing is to see if it's... It's tart. <laughs> <laughs> So it's not ready. <laughs> not ready. Not ready. Not ready at all. Okay. We leave this step later. Yes, <laughs> Let me try. <laughs> we, we leave it there for another. <laughs> yep. Yeah, we go and put the other one there. If it's not ready, if it's no, leave it. But it tastes nice. So you can have it. Mm -hmm. I'll take it. That tastes good. It's your kind of... Ugh. It's my kind. This is the time when the... It's, this is the time when the stores take it. Yeah. You take that bucket and pick it over one more. This is the... When it's like this... When it's like this... The farmers... The mass producers... They get it from... They get it... They get it like this and by the time it gets to the stores... I don't know which one you're talking about. There's the one in the middle here. Yeah. Because it's for the sugar. Yeah. It's for the sugar. That one for the eating. I like the black one. Oh, oh. Patricia's harvesting some oranges. Uncle's getting some sugar cane. I'm eating some tart ones. I'm trying to show the world that you're you're harvesting. You're a farmer today, <laughs> harvesting oranges. Uh, yeah, just going into the bucket. Oh my gosh! Show your friends. Smile. You gotta send some friends. Came all the way here. To perform. That's right. Get the experience <laughs> of living off the land. Living off the land. Oh. Oh, that's a lot of oranges. Look at that. Pick it all. Is this what you call navel oranges? I call them oranges. I don't know what they what species. Oh, I missed one on the other side. Uncle's harvesting some sugar, sugar canes for you. That's my favorite part of it. Yeah. Whoa! Patricia's harvesting oranges. Living off the land. Pretty cool. You want to say, say anything to anybody? Yeah. <laughs> Don't know.
Spending quality time with family. That's right, quality time. Quality. I am harvesting an orange. One out of this whole tree that Patricia picked. Mm. One orange. And look at Uncle. He's got a sugar cane for Patricia. Look at that, she's so happy. So happy she's got a sugar cane. Oh. All right, hello world. All right, show the world how you eat a sugar cane. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. Yeah, real quick. Within a minute. Oh my gosh. You got a minute. That's it. Take it and bite it. And look at this. Enjoying. Don't judge until you try it. Don't judge until you try it. That's right. Very sweet. Eating a sugar cane in Australia. Awesome. How's it feel to live off the land in Australia? It's work alongside of a mountain, that's for sure. Walking alongside of a mountain. Finding all the plots where we planted stuff. Eating sugar cane and oranges and Australia walking the farm. We've been out here for a while. Uh, 42 acres of pure joy alongside the mountain. Now I'm chasing after Uncle. He is 70. How old is Uncle? 72? 69? Dang. 69 years old and look at him. He's all over the place on this mountain. Yeah, 69, and I'm dying. <gasps> yep, you hear that? Some kind of bird out here. All different kinds of sounds. <sighs> We're away from the city. All I hear is animals. Animals in the jungle. I got wild dogs, dingoes, kangaroos, wild kangaroos, wild turkeys, uh, let's see, iguanas, uh, bow snakes, uh, they got tons of snakes, they got some poisonous spiders, I don't know what they are, they're all around, they're around here somewhere, I'm just trying to stay up in the open, don't want to accidentally get over someone's, someone's Home. Uncle's over here. Look at that. He's clearing the foliage around his farm. He's got to keep up with it. Keep up with it, or else the jungle will overgrow it. Overgrow over it. Kangaroo. Yeah. Hopefully, you guys saw that kangaroo. Give me that rope there, me go to the. To our little swimming hole down there, we can to it because uh -huh. they all grow back. <laughs> have a little swimming hole when the water's yeah. running right down yeah. there in the creek. Yeah. Well, everything's okay. I've got some trees out there. It's everything's good. looking good. Yeah. Had to inspect the, inspect the land, make sure you can get through. Sure. That's our water. That's our water tank. It is to suck the water from the the creek here to water our plant. But we didn't bother to do it again, so just leave it. We're gonna shift it up to the house this thing, so we can uh, put some more water. Uh huh. But this is our caravan. We come and uh, spend the weekend. Yeah. Yeah, we. Well, because we only clear uh, when we move here and wait for the house to fill. At least we come the weekend, me and Amy, we do some work here. This is where we sit. Yeah, we do our work. Back in the day. Sunday morning, we pack our bag, off we go. Because we work on, on Monday. 
Oh, gee, that's a lot of orange. Mm -hmm. <laughs> wow. I didn't know we got many. Yeah, oh, that's the whole cool. tree. <laughs> <laughs> She's enjoying. I feel like a kid all over again. I feel like a kid all over again with the sugar cane. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> still kicking and screaming after all these years. It's still right. We're gonna, we're gonna, pull, gonna do a big job. Uh huh. The government's gonna repair the whole thing. So because it's really still really good, there's something to come down here. If you, yeah. If you relax. wanna sleep, you just pop in and sleep. <laughs> Yeah, the only thing is we try to cover just in case a, a snake get in. Yeah. Because okay. If you get a snake, a snake in, it will be in there. Oh, you got a spider in there. Yeah. Dead. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Some, what kind of spider is that? Yeah. Oh, just a... Uh, I think it's dead there. Yeah. There was some big one here, John. Yeah, is some that a big... poison spider or no? No, nah, no. Nah. Not that one? No, the poison one and those guys with the, a red, red back. Oh, okay. The red back spider. Those are the one they, uh, they sold off. Uh, yeah, because this one I was worried because they stopped feeling because uh, mm -hmm. I'm going to do the. But if I got the money, I'm going to do it. I was going to pull this one up to the house and repair it up there. Mm -hmm. But we, we're we going to go through that guy's property. We can't because. Uh, you we can't, can't go through it up there? No, they're too many, uh, too narrow. To pull up the mm -hmm. up there. This is where we come and put our, our tools when we come down here. This is where all our tools we put down. Uh, it's a nice little shed. Yeah, we're putting in to put our tools now because we most of our tools are taken up there. Mm -hmm. And we leave only the one we use it oh. down here because it's. So it yeah. looks like you got a live spider over there at the back. Oh, yeah, is that, that, is that, that, that oh, that's small. That's small. Yeah, is that a poisonous yeah. one or no? No, no, no. It's not, but that's small. No, but that's some big. people they scare when they look at a big one. Yeah. Uh, nah, that really, that really, like uh, some of those uh, bad ones, they uh, find all those guys, they really. The one you can see in uh -huh. America and some other places. <laughs> but I haven't seen uh, the black spider here. The one is the red black spider. Hey, people are saying, but some people are lady who don't see. Some people they don't. That's what I'm thinking. That's myself. Yeah. You know, the first thing is you prepare your water fish before you do any other thing. If you got a, if you got a, if you, that's another thing, you got to look at the property and have a look if you got a moisture or you can, because we, 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 we ask the guy, they drill the water from underground. Yeah. Yeah. How much, uh, how many tents can you have on your, up there? It's up to you. We go. Yeah. Go up. Look at that. Yeah, look at that. And look how this much you weigh. This is what I came here for. Sugar cane. <laughs> came here all the way from America. Mm -hmm. From America for sugar cane. Well, Trisha's been talking about. <laughs> That's house. Here's the house. Yeah. Oh, the, we had the uh, last month. We that's the last time because they, they was walking around down there, down from the house. We're really surprised here. Uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, they're good. when they come in, they come and go. They come and go. They're not staying in one place. They go where the food is. 
name all the wild animals. Oh, <laughs> he probably, yeah, probably, probably he's around here. No, because it's a good day. He will. Yeah. He'll come because it's a, 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 a good day. He's a... <laughs> no, I'm not going to get attacked. <laughs> not going to get attacked by an old iguana. Yeah, especially if there's three of them. That's Joshua the iguana. This is why this house is on stilts. Because of the wild animals around here. If you're wondering why this house is on stilts. Because of the iguanas and all the other creatures. They got 42 acres alongside a mountain. And backed against a national forest. It's pretty awesome. All I hear is a lot of birds. Um, haven't heard a koala yet. Saw kangaroos. Um, haven't seen any wild dingoes or anything. But they're out there. That's what they say. That's Smurfy. Smurfy the kangaroo comes around, says hi. Smurfy! Hi, Smurfy! Yep, there he is. Smurfy! Look at Patricia. She is still <laughs> eating sugar cane. Sugar cane. Still gnawing on it. She's still gnawing on the sugar cane. You hear the birds all up in the jungle. So apparently, I just ate some of this sugar cane out of sequence. <laughs> Something about biting it all wrong, eating it all wrong. Oh my gosh. I'm on vacation. I can eat sugar cane any way I like. Just remember that on vacation. Sugar cane, any way I like. But yet, my wife wants me to eat it a certain way. And I don't know what way that is. Hey! Look at that. That sugar cane was so awesome. I think that was nearly, what, three feet? Almost three feet of sugar cane? <laughs> and it's down to six inches left. That was really, really good. She has not stopped all day on it. Almost done. He'll stop. She'll stop when it's done. Her blood sugar's going through the roof. Blood sugar's going through the roof because of that. Might as well finish it off. Peace. Good stuff. Good stuff. Hearing all the critters out here, enjoying, enjoying what's left of the staying in the jungle. It's so awesome, beautiful. Had egg on toast this morning. Very nice, very nice. We're about ready to head on out to Brisbane and enjoying the rest of the day with family going along the Gold Coast. All right, so yeah, we're right on the Gold Coast here. Oh yeah, I'm gonna miss it. I'm gonna miss this life, look at this. Living in the jungle, the forest of Australia. Listening to all the different types of bird sounds. They have so many different types of bird sounds out here. 
I still think one of them sounds like monkeys. You know? But, no monkeys. And then the iguanas, the kangaroos that come around. The spiders. The snakes. All that good stuff. I gotta watch where I'm walking. Alright. I'm gonna miss the dangers of living out in the jungle of Australia. Yeah. All right. All right, the wife was calling me because she saw Smurfy and I thought she needed me to do some chores, but I gotta come back down here to say goodbye to Smurfy. Smurfy's over here. All right, so we're gonna go say goodbye. Where is she? Hi, Smurfy. There's Smurfy. Get Smurfy. Right there. How's it going, Smurfy? Can you see her? She's busy eating. She's busy eating. Smurfy's eating. Don't want to crowd her. I think she, I believe it's a, a girl kangaroo. Smurfy. Let's see. Alright, let's try this again. Oh, she is so small. Smurfy's so small. She's over there eating. So small. Yeah. So that's the, uh, the main kangaroo I've seen. I've seen a whole pack of them. Yeah, two days ago. Was it two days? It was like two days ago. A whole pack of them. Can you hear the birds? Oh my god. They're busy making noises. That's the neighbors. Tell the neighbors to be quiet. Be quiet, neighbors. Too much noise. You act like we're in the city. Quiet! Ah! Oh. Listen to that. And then there's a crow. That one's gotta be a crow. Oh my god. I hope you guys can hear that. Wonka Bong! Oh yeah. The baby, baby. Where is he at? Not yet. Wonka bong. I don't know if you saw the other bread that's there. Yeah. Oh, I see Wonka bong. She, he is a tiny little creature. Tiny little creature. Wonka bong is on the other. Here's Wonka bong. Wonka bong. Look at Wonka Bong. Snuck in in front of Johnny this morning. Hey, come on. Thanks for your help. Coming out of the land. Going back down. Coming back down. To the coast. Coming down from the mountain. Look at that. Pretty awesome. Now we're going back to the city. Going back to the city. <laughs>